It's the Pang International Circuit where the Welcome to another episode of Ben's Carnage. Today we're playing Formula One 2015 career mode. So if you haven't seen the first episode, go and check it out now because I'm going to give away a little spoiler. So we finished in fifth position, which wasn't too bad after the amount of carnage we had. So we're in the second race of the season. We're in Bahrain. We're in the desert. Let's go. Carnaged. So we're starting from fourth position again. Our qualifying has been quite good recently. And the lights are going out of Bahrain. And we go, go, go. As a Mercedes goes shooting off into the distance. And Vettel tries to cover me off. Not giving me any space whatsoever. Will allow space for the Williams to dive around me. Outside I've been, I've been hit. I got slightly touched there, I don't know who it was by, but I dropped a position, I'm into fifth position, so can we go up and make up some positions as we go upside the inside of Massa and we get the move done, so we're up into fourth position. So let's go and carnage the Mercedes. So we come across the line for our first lap of the race. And at the moment, we are quicker than Massa, and we're catching up to Vettel, so it could be a very promising race. Can we go and get our first race win of the season? Let's go and get Carnage. Vettel is getting held up an absolute treat by Rosberg, I believe. Which is letting Hamilton scapper off into the distance. Maybe this is tactics by the Mercedes team. So as we come across the line for the end of lap 5. I'm going to provide you with a quick update. So practically our pace is better than Massa. But we're not quicker than the Vettel or the two Mercedes. So at the moment we're just sitting in a net position of 4th. It's coming up to the pit stop period in the next 1 or 2 laps. So we can see if we can get a little undercut on one of the Mercedes and our teammate. To see if we can progress up any positions. As you can see Bottas has got past his teammate Massa and moved up into 5th position. So maybe he'll be quicker and put me under some pressure. So as we come across into the pits from 4th from position... So I can see one of the leaders of pit. So I believe it is a Mercedes. I'm not sure. Oh, it's Lewis Hamilton. So Lewis Hamilton pit first. So Mercedes giving the preferential treatment to Hamilton. As which is right because he is in the lead of the race and ahead of his teammate. So now we need to put in a qualifying lap. And let's see if we can carnage Vettel. So we was about five seconds behind him before the before the pit stops. So let's see if we can eat into his time. We're coming up to the back of Felipe Nazar in tenth position and Maldonado in ninth position. So hopefully at the end of the straight we can get DRS and we can get Carnage. So we're coming up to the back of the straight. Got the DRS, but so is NASA, but surely we've got a quicker engine, a fresh and new Ferrari engine. Maldonado. So we dive bomb. As Maldonado pulls into the pits. And so does Felipe and NASA. So they've been carnaged. Now it'd be interesting to see where Sebastian Vettel comes out and how far ahead of me, or will we get ahead of him? Let's see. So no, Vettel is still ahead of us, so the undercut didn't make us 
make up the five second gap but let's see if it's closer than five seconds and see if we've made any ground on Sebastian Vettel no it's in fact increased by a second but we've extended our lead because at the end of the tyre west's first stint Bottas was starting to reel us in a little bit so it's consoli consolidated consider oh good Finch be a genius con I don't know retained that's the easy word just practically retained our fourth position so I just think I'll talk you quickly through what this season is it's uh, obviously a Formula 1 career mode Kimi Raikkonen I'm in the Ferrari trying to dethrone the Mercedes I'm on expert level with the only traction control I have on and the racing line are the only assists I have on apart from that everything's off so hopefully in the next race I can try to challenge the Mercedes and Vettel because our pace hasn't been there in this race it hasn't been a very exciting race because our pace has been slower than Vettel and the Mercedes but it's been quicker than Bottas and Massa in 5th and 6th position respectively wait a minute is that Vettel in the pits? Vettel's in the pits maybe he's had a collision I'm up into 3rd could this be the first podium of the season? this is carnage Vettel has been carnaged. So as we're coming across for the final lap of the race, still sitting in third position, 11 seconds off Rosberg and a big gap behind to Rosberg. So Vettel had to pit again, I'm not sure why, but I ain't complaining because this is going to be my first podium position of the season. As you can see, Vettel has got past the other Williams, so he is in 5th position. So can he chase down Bottas and indeed make it a Ferrari 3 and 4 before the end of the race? So as Lewis Hamilton wins the race, he's indeed reversed the form to Rosberg with the positions being the other way around this time with Hamilton and winning and Rosberg second to put them I believe on the same points in the championship we contain a brilliant third position a podium spot Vettel my teammate he's been carnaged so as you can see Vettel indeed finished fifth he made two pit stops don't know why so Hamilton wins a race and Rosberg three seconds off the pace so that brings us to the driver standings we sit in fourth position the same points as Vettel one ahead of Bottas and 18 behind the Mercedes so yeah it will take a lot of effort to stop the Mercedes domination. So yeah guys, if you like that episode, leave a like. Comment below, do you think we'll be able to stop the Mercedes domination? And remember guys, let's get carnage.